Sam Bankman Freed was sentenced to 25 years in prison uh, today. Uh, Judge Kaplan found that while Sam did express some remorse for what happened, he believed that Sam would be uh, most likely to commit crimes again and that the multi-billion dollar fraud that he caused, uh, that he had uh, over at FTX uh, is something that could potentially happen in the future. So he has been sentenced for 25 years in prison. Sam uh, appeared somewhat uh, robotic or unemotional when he addressed the court um, ahead of sentencing. He did uh, express some remorse about what happened. He continues to share that he believes that customers at FTX will eventually have their funds returned to them in the bankruptcy process. But he didn't really feel like he was apologetic or deeply remorseful for what he did. Uh, Sam, who was wearing a uh, beige prisoner garb uh, after he was walked out of uh, after sentencing, uh, did not look back at the audience and uh, kept his hands behind his back uh, as he was taken away. Prosecutors had been looking for 40 to 50 years from, uh, for Sam Bankman Freed for his crimes. Uh, Judge Kaplan, as he uh, imposed the sentence on Sam, said that he felt like the prosecutor's recommendations was overly harsh. Um, however, he felt that the, the, the size of the crime and the number of victims uh, justified a significant sentence against Sam Bankman Freed. The uh, federal sentencing guidelines require that he's, he serve at least 80% of his, of his term. So that would be 20 years, which would make Sam about four, uh, 52 by the time he leaves prison. During the trial, prosecutors repeatedly referenced Bernie Madoff, the former uh, Ponzi scheme fraudster from 15 years ago, as a, a, compar a comparison to Sam Bankman Freed. While his attorneys tried to portray him as an, a innocent executive where things went wrong, that story was not bought by the judge. The judge did buy the comparison to Bernie Madoff and other Ponzi scheme fraudsters over the years.